Hey guys, this is Andreas recording from sunny Cyprus. I'm actually leaving to go back to London in about a few hours, but I wanted to make a really quick video before I do that. Firstly, because I haven't made a video in three weeks, but also because there's something I see a lot and I really want to talk to you about. And this is letting your job define who you are as a person. A lot of times when people meet me for the first time and I tell them I did computer science, they tell me, oh really, you don't look like a computer scientist. And even though I kind of like it when I hear it, because, you know, it's nice to break from the stereotype. I always say to myself, what the fuck does that mean? What does a computer scientist look like? Is it a skinny dude living in his mom's basement, having zero social skills and being a complete introvert? This is a classic example of assigning a person an identity because of simply what they choose to do for a living. But the problem is a lot of people do choose to lead that way. I see a lot of people where the only thing they do is they go to the job early and they leave late. And the only thing they care about is their job and they don't have any hobbies, any interests or anything else outside the job. So they get all their validation for being good at the job and they have nothing else to talk for or show outside the nine to five or seven to eight or whatever hours job. By the way, I just had a guy park his car directly across my camera. There's so much fucking space here. I don't know why he did that. Anyway, and many people actually don't even know what they want to do for a job. Like for example, I wanted to be a filmmaker when I was younger and then I chose to do computer science and now I have a job suited to that field and I like it. But it doesn't mean that's what I wanted to do from the beginning. And also it doesn't mean I want to do that all the time. So if you're in a similar situation to me, or even if you knew what you wanted to do from the beginning, you should always have some flexibility in your life to do something else besides your job. It is crucially important to have friends, interests, hobbies, outside the field where you work because at the end of the day having multiple experiences like this is what's gonna make you a more interesting three-dimensional person instead of being the guy or girl who goes out and the only thing they can talk about is programming and how well they did their job and what projects they worked on no one really wants to talk about the stuff outside work i do sometimes find myself talking about machine learning or whatever off the clock because i do find it interesting but this is not what most conversations should be like and that's gonna limit you from meeting interesting people who don't happen to like your particular field because let's face it not everyone likes computers and programming and machine learning and stuff like that. You need to have more things going on in your life. The other problem with identifying with your job and having nothing outside that is that whatever happens on your job, it's like your life depends on it. It's like you do a good job, you feel good. Something goes wrong at work, you feel depressed. You feel like you think it's the only thing your value comes from and you end up spending your whole life making like a really nice impression at work when you're like 60 years old and you retire or whatever. All your memories are you working in that job and trying to make it to the top without really having anything else. And if you're doing a sprint of like one or two years where you work really hard, like a friend of his job and you're planning to save money to have fun later that's okay i guess for the short run but on the long run you really don't want to live a life like this forever so the message of this video is do not identify with your job do your job well but have other things on the side have other interests have other hobbies and have other friends and if you do this you'll be one of the few interesting people on this planet and your life will be much more fun and exciting immerse yourself in activities outside your workspace and be the computer scientist who doesn't look like a computer scientist. Please subscribe to my channel and click on the like button and notifications so you know when I'm releasing a new video. And if you like my videos, please share them with other people because the channel right now is growing very, very slowly. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to go catch my plane. Leave any comments below and I'll see you next time. Take care.